All right, to make our geomet geometric design, what we need to start with is a piece of paper, and it needs to be a specific size, a size that you can, uh, that you know the numerical factors of. So, for example, this is a piece of paper that is 12 inches square. It's 12 inches this way by 12 inches that way. We know that factors of 12 are 3 and 4. So I've got some 4-inch green squares and some 4-inch yellow squares. So in order to make a design, what I'm going to do is start out by placing the squares on here. I'm going to come up with a design that fits inside the 12 inches. Since these are 4-inch squares, I know that I'm going to end up having these 4-inch squares in a pattern of three. So if you look at it this way, three this way, three that way, you could look at it here. We have to count the blue as a square, so one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. It comes out to uh, make where I have three four inch squares inside that 12 inch square. So there's a design. Now I want to add some interest to it. I want to introduce another color and I have my four inch green squares. And I'm going to lay that one on the center. And I'm still going to have to work with this pattern of three since four and three are a factor of 12. So one thing I could do is get this straightened out just a little bit. I'll put my squares in a design like this. Straighten these up before I glue them. And again, I've got the same thing. I've got a pattern of three. I've got a consistent number of three that runs through this design. I've got three squares that go this way, three squares that go that way. And that's because three and four are numerical factors of 12. If you know the, if you know the factors, it's real easy to come up with a design. Just make sure that you have numbers that you can work with. 